All right, guys. Well, we get started here. I know this is a um, uh, impromptu meeting right now. It's the holidays. I know we got Angel and uh, Phyllis and let me see, uh, Jeff and uh, Isan. And uh, so we just get started. We just wanted to go over some updates. First things first. Let's hear from the man himself, who's in bad day. Uh, so share with us what, the excitement of what he saw. All right, Jeff, take it away, bro. <laughs> What's up, everybody? What's going on? So, yeah, I'm rocking our actual uh, manufacturing company that we bought. It's called Lazy Magnolia, baby. And on the shirt, they got the band token. Oh, baby. check it out. So, uh, <laughs> this, this project is fire. Uh, being able to pull up to the actual manufacturing company and talk to the workers and the sales manager and to get a full tour of the drinks and how many drinks we can produce an hour, right? So we were able to produce 5,000 drinks an hour, right? 5,000 drinks an hour. Um, I seen this, I'm gonna show you all the videos, but I, you know, that, but it's like every, we get a nickel off of every, every drink in production, okay? Um, a nickel, okay? So that's super powerful. When you're looking at 5,000 uh, bottles going out, in, in an hour, that was just the uh, the glass bottles. We're not talking about the canned goods. We're not the, the canned beers and the, and the drinks. We're not talking about the little, uh, the, even the co-packer stuff. Like it's amazing. So what happened is, um, being there, like they won awards for like the best tasting beer, and that also brings notoriety to us. We also got our drinks in these bars, so we got the tap ones. So that you know they're they're buying kegs and and pony kegs and sending them out. So like, Jeff, it, what, what kind of what kind of drinks are they? Someone kept asking, what kind of drinks are they? Bevs, I, I didn't quite. Know. What kind of drinks overall? Just a quick summary. And the the so said beer. Yeah, so wow. we got majority. Their 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 main money makers are beers. We also got some seltzer waters. We got some um regular water that you can buy in Kroger. So it's, it's in Kroger's right now. Um, the the water the water is some of the beers are. It's called it's called I'm, it's the name of the thing water, but the water's pretty good. They got this this sour uh, sour juice. It's, it was good. I ain't gonna lie, but it was it was it was a cold packer. It was like it was. They're like, man, we make profit over there because it's somebody else's company, right? And we just bottle and package it and, and ship it out. So we got a crazy profit margin on that. Uh, but it's really good. It's like you know, it was like I'm sour sucker. It's like sour, but it's fruity. Was really good. I ain't gonna lie. Um, um, uh, so yeah, uh, social waters. But like I said, now that we took it over, the, the marketing guy like, just just write me a blank check. I, I know how to make this thing pop. And so we give him free range. He, he's about to expand all that we can do in the different in the different like uh, like bottles, the little juicy juices, and all that stuff. Um, the little wine coolers we got, and it, I mean the, the stuff tastes good. Now I'm not a drinker, so. I had a little little shot glass of the beer. Oh, that had me right. I ain't gonna lie. I was like, this thing good. And it hit. So I see why the number one. I also asked that question. I also, we also gotta speak to the chemist, the guy who makes all the all the beers. And he just educated us on like, it's not about the best beer, it's the best beer for the situation. I said, Wow, okay. So, you know, far as you got certain beers that work perfect in the sun when you're on the beach. Certain beer that work perfect in the bars, certain beer that work perfect in the house. Like it's just the the I was like, that's gangster. I never thought about it like that, but that when I and I'm gonna show you that video. Like I didn't know that this beer that got ten percent alcohol is perfect outside because the heat and when you drink a cold one or thing, it does something to you chemically. It's, it's crazy. Versus you in the house, you want to drink an eight percent one. You know, it's crazy. So he breaks that whole thing down. Um, the sales guy is super happy. Because he like got we got we got new machinery in there, like we got like we we, we spent like millions of dollars on the machinery so we can expand and make the the uh, the production even that much faster. Um, uh, what else? What, what I want to share share with you guys about that? Like, oh, the labeling should be um this next quarter is when the labeling should be should be going on. So they, right now it's the new quarter. The labels we now have our debt box joining it. So in about a week or two. We should have our labels piled by the debt box on the side of every bottle. So that's going to be super exciting. Um, uh, the town loves us. They're like, man, you guys are, 
uh, taking over from our last owners, cool. And then they got a whole community that comes to their to so in the manufacturing company, it has its own bar, but they got a club where everybody get a custom mug and they keep their mug at the at the at the brewery. So when so when they come and say, Oh, give what's your locker number? Locker number 10, they come, rest their mug out, and boom. They got their own custom mug powdery. Oh yeah. I got the indestructible, indestructible uh uh, 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 jug. This one is pretty dope, right? I got, I got another class. I got the, uh, my own. So this is like, you know, it's, we're proud to be owners of this, right? Look at this, Ma Lady Magnolia glass, right? So now, yeah, this is pretty dope stuff. So now that we able to say we get paid off of every bottle that comes out of this manufacturing company, is off the chain. Um, and so we're excited about that. So we talked about that a little bit, well, a lot of it actually. Talked about drip now. Drip. So the debt, the debt, the the, the, de uh, the debit card. They they doing their next test in the states. They were doing a test globally because it's hard to have somebody do a a a a, a KYC overseas because half the cats don't have licenses, half the cats don't got you know passports or, or stuff like that because they're not the country, right? So how you do a KYC for a debit card when when half these cats. If they got a license, they, they um um it's a paper license, right? In India, or um it's no like ID, right? It's like a paper license for their well, they face on it's like kind of like a permit. You know, you get your permit and you there's no paper, no there's no ID on your permit, it's just a paper saying that you are permitted to drive. It's like that in India, like the fact what they uh, what they have on other countries. So they're going through the process uh, and now in the, in America. Um we just going through that process with the, with, the, with the test, like a hundred. They're going to test over a hundred people in America, uh, and once that's done, they're going to open up Swipe. But right now, I think swiping. I'm not too sure if Swipe will come out this month. I think Drip might come out this month. I'm not too sure, but Drip, Lord, baby Jesus, like Drip. We want to get as many likes as possible because I think it's, they're going to be able to um, uh, feed the entire uh, ecosystem. Basically, the basically, is, I want to get it right. He said. The amount of coins you would normally make in a year with drip, you're gonna make that in two months. I say, whoa. So meaning it's gonna be a lot of tokens given out with drip, I believe, in the beginning, right? And that's when we wanna own as many contracts with the drip as possible to get as many tokens as, as possible. So <laughs> I'm, I'm over there over one of my guys like, man, what I gotta do? I gotta rob a bank real quick, man. So, <laughs> so I can get this, get this drip money up. I don't yeah. I'm mean, like, yeah, don't tell. Don't, just rob the bank, give me some money. Don't, don't tell me how you got it, then, okay? <laughs> but yeah, you like, like, yo, Jeff, what I gotta do? We gotta rob a bank real quick. Make be ready for this. Um, so that's going. That's exciting as heck, y'all. Um, hey, Jeff, is that drip? Um, uh, an ecosystem that's already out there. What is drip? Cause... Drip is water. Okay, so drip is there is an, water. there is an ecosystem out there that I'm a part of called drip. This is totally different. Right? I know. It's totally yeah. different. Okay. This this so drip is also going to be tied into Bev. Kind of give you a little hint. Drip is going to be tied into Bev. So, like meaning drip is going to be able to feed Bev because of the water. Because just yeah, just know know that. Um, the aluminum project. I was saying I thought the aluminum project they used some of the aluminum from the project to actually send to the manufacturing company. But that's that's not it's not true because they they get aluminum for cheaper here than try to export it from Ghana to to America to put the aluminum for the cans here. So they just get they just get it cheaper and cheaper here by just getting it in state than try to export it from Ghana where we own the aluminum mines to uh, to America in order to use the cans for our manufacturing company. So that's not that's not happening. Um, other than other news. So Jeff, what's what's the uh, so what's the how the so basically we got Explorer and Illuminate on sale right now to the fourteenth. So we should be focusing and getting those two out out the way, right? That is the focus. Right? Getting a thousand dollars off per license of the drip. I mean of the drip. Of aluminum and explore. That's the focus. Right. Uh so we need to make sure we get as much aluminum and the explore as possible. Before the 14th, I want to say before the 13th, because what's going to happen is either either we're going to get it or it's going to sell out, right? 
one of the two. Right. And so people know this is the last week to get the aluminum explorer for the for the thousand off. Right. So it's like getting a bev license. I mean, it's like getting a, a block license or yeah. a bev license. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Bev um, bev is up to thirty five hundred now. I know. I know. Yeah, and, yeah, and, yeah. And, it's, and it's only two hundred it's only two hundred left officially. The guy Luke, he told us, you know, like guys, I know you guys don't know this, but Luke is the guy who who who, who, uh, who um who on boards and, uh, and 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 activate your license in the back office. So he actually he's the one that knows the, the exact count. Cause that's the one who activates our our license once once payment is received. Um, so Luke, like, hey guys, just to give you a hint, there's only two hundred uh more bears from the debt side and from IX side, like total. Like I know it's you no, know, so totally. And then once that's gone, you get ready for the NFT. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Get ready for him. That's how right there. Yeah, yeah. So uh Dwayne so, Dwayne bought his explorer. I just helped him buy it. So he's got his explorer in the lock. So and then we got Boomy coming on Thursday. Okay. So guys, if you got if you guys are thinking next like slice it, let's get it. If you guys are yeah, watching this recording, Jeff is bringing the news fresh from Bev Day, saw with his own eyes. The economics behind the tokens. Well, meanwhile, we're just accumulating coins. What some coins today? Just accumulating coins, so that when the mark and I watched that one hour uh, Bitcoin history, that was on point, bro. It's uh, you know, a hundred dollars that crashed from two hundred to a hundred because somebody dumped a whole bunch of Bitcoin. Yep, yep, that sounds familiar. It's crazy, man. Yeah, let, let me tell you something, guys. You, what you saw in the market, think about. I want you guys to understand what's really going on here. We've been mining. We've been mining for 15 years. We finally figured out how to tokenize what we've been mining. November of 2021. We're still a baby in the tokenomics behind commodities. Okay. November 2021 is we found out how to find tokenize when the first tokenomics backed by commodity from us went live. Okay. So, a lot of these projects is new for the tokenomics being wrapped around it, right? And we haven't even been in the company for six months, y'all. So, when you look at the Bitcoin, the rise and rise of Bitcoin, and you see the, the, the coins dropping, first of all, Bev and, and Blocks had to drop because we had to sell tokens to the to, to the uh, to the exchanges, right? In order for us, in order for us, in order for us to go public, you got to sell so that people can buy. Because we're the miners. Right? So we have to give up tokens in order for them to get tokens. That's the only way are going to get it from us mining and selling it. That's like you mining oil, you mining uh, 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 corn, but it ain't going to do nothing until you sell the corn and the oil. Right? So when you sell, token price, market price goes down. So here's like I like to paint the picture. We're the miners. We didn't pay not one red cent for the tokens that they, that was produced and that's being produced. What we paid for was the tool to mine the oil out of the ground. Let me paint a picture. If you went to Nebraska and they said there's oil here, and they said all you need to do is buy the drill that's gonna allow you to mine the oil out the ground, and this drill is a thousand dollars. You start mining. We not care what the cost of the oil cost right now. We just want to get as many oil out the ground so that when it's time to sell it, we can sell it. So now I got a hundred barrels of oil right now. But the market prices, it dropped down to a dollar. That means that the, all they're gonna pay is a dollar for our oil right now. You can choose to sell it a dollar, or you can say, mm, I don't need to sell it right now. I'm gonna just hold it. Now what happens is the world's happening, gas price going up. Now, everybody who sold for a dollar, they ain't got enough money, enough gold or oil to sell at $5. But I do because I didn't need to sell right now. But when it was the $5 gallon, oh, now it's time to sell. And I'm not going to sell all of it still. I'm going to sell and, a fraction of what I need. Okay. And, and, the, and the thing is, Jeff, we know for a fact that they're going to get royalty payments. They're gonna do a burn and take the tokens out of circulation. 
And guess yes. what? If some people sold tokens at a low price, that's more tokens they can buy with the money they're getting. Let's say you're going to yes. get a $5 million royalty payment and it, and the tokens are half price, they're going to double the tokens they thought they were going to take out of the market with that same price because you use the same $5 million. Um, you love me. No, no, <laughs> so, I'm, saying, I'm saying, let's say they know on the 15th they're getting $5 million of royalty payments coming in. They're going to right. buy whatever $5 million buys. If the tokens are down a half price right now, mm -hmm. they're going to buy double the tokens than they anticipated mm -hmm. with that $5 million, which is more yeah, tokens out of circulation. Yeah, it's correct. So what, down what, the what, road, what, when they buy again another $5 million, there's less tokens available because they bought more than they thought at a low price. And, then, yeah, and then the and price goes up. Yep, it's going to be a higher price back then. Yeah. But what I'm saying to you is, is we're, 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 what we're doing is we're... we're you can you can sell whatever you want to sell. That's what's so powerful about this. Now that now that Bev is now that Bev is live, you can sell all the Bev tokens in the world you want to sell. That's the beautiful thing about us being liquid versus somebody staking, right? The, but the question is, do you really want to sell your tokens at thirty five cents? I mean, you're still in profit because you didn't pay for the token. All you did was pay for the drill to drill the oil out the ground. When you go buy a a a a, a to go do what Adobe Pro? Are you like, man? I mean, I can't wait to get my. I'm gonna go make Adobe Pro so I can get my money back. I paid for the license to get Adobe Pro. No, you are not even worry about what you pay for the license because what, what, what that license is allowing you to do now, right? So what our license is allowing us to accumulate tokens for free and hold until we want to sell it. If you want to sell it thirty five cents, no problem. Go on sell it. If you want to sell it a dollar twenty one. No problem. Go ahead and sell it. But the but. So so what you're saying is we don't worry about the value of the tokens. We just accumulate tokens that we own at some point. When the value dictates it, we can move it from what we need to. It's up to us. Right. What I'm what I'm here's what I'm really saying. I don't want to sell a near token until I have millions of them. I don't want to sell a near token. I want to accumulate as much tokens before the price goes up. I want to have millions and millions of tokens per project before the price goes up because that means that same thousand dollars that you want right now. You got to sell half your portfolio to get that thousand dollars. When you have millions of tokens, you probably need to sell a hundred tokens to get that same thousand dollars. Right. You so, so now we should just be mining the tokens, getting the licenses, accumulating tokens, and and just wait for the economics to kick in. Exactly, because we I'm, know I'm, for sure every month they're burning, to, they're getting the royalty permits. Every month they're burning tokens, so it's a matter of time because there's only X amount of tokens in the ecosystem. Yeah, and he also said, "Y'all see, it says one trillion tokens." But because of the burn, it's not gonna. You're not even gonna get nowhere near one, one trillion tokens. You're probably getting one percent of the one trillion by the time the burns happen and the, and the halving happening. It's not even gonna be one trillion tokens being available to the marketplace because they gotta do a halving and they gotta do burns. Which so it's like, I, just stick just stick around long enough and y'all understand it. I just have to see it unfold. Does that make sense? All I want to tell you is this. Your goal or my goal or our goal should be to have millions of tokens per project in our portfolio before we even think about selling any of them. I gave you guys the example of my Nat G at a million and one of my teams in Nat G at eight million, right? When it goes to one cent, I'm getting 10, she's getting 80. I'm getting 10,000, she's getting 80,000 coins for that same one cent. Why? Because we're in the millions. When I seen Travis deposit thirty five million in one day, if that's thirty five million times that same penny is three hundred fifty thousand dollars. That's not a penny. Bev's at thirty something cents. It didn't open up at one twenty one on the market. It opened up at forty one cents in the market. What you saw was. The ad tokenomics working when people all are buying and no one is selling. That's what you saw. That dollar twenty one. That's what it looks like when everybody's buying and no one's selling. 
the moment someone sells, it now resets the price based on who's selling. So the key is the more people that's buying and, and holding, it will offset the selling. Meaning our value still be up more because it's more of us holding than selling. And so when it's time to sell, you'll be selling what you want to sell. It's going to drop, but it's going to reset because somebody's going to buy. I'm so happy somebody spent, somebody sold $500,000 worth of, somebody sold $500,000 of their debt tokens. It dropped the price from $15 to $10. I got excited. I just bought 20 of them. Right, because when I came in the game, it was only ten dollars of the a uh, uh, a debt token, and I saw that thing go from ten to forty, and I missed out on that thirty dollar increase. Now imagine you had see, <laughs> oh my God, if you you had the license, we are in, we're in the project right now. We're in these projects, and I just saw I saw with my own eyes two projects that we have went from. One was thirty percent, with thirty a thirty dollar increase per coin, and um, gold was sixty four dollars, and went from sixty four dollars to a hundred dollars. So that's a thirty six dollar increase per per gram. Right. What I'm seeing is I was here when it went up. These two fighters went up by thirty dollar per coin. Imagine if I had millions of freaking coins in that project. Then I'll sell some of it. Because it would only be a fraction to get a big payday. Do you understand? Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. The economics oh are crazy. So now that I went back down to ten dollars, I'm scooping. Yeah. Because I saw it go up. And I know it's gonna go up again. And he also told us what we need to do to get the that the, the, that token on on Binance. Okay. What do we have to All do to get it on Binance? We need is a, I think it's a, 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 a um, a hundred thousand likes on Inst on Twitter, some old dumb stuff. He said we got four hundred thousand license holders, but we only got X Y and uh, we got to have I think a million, a million, um, a million. Oh uh, no, I'm sorry, a hundred thousand likes on Twitter on the Twitter account. Um, um, I think a hundred thousand something in the. He gonna give us. What he's going to do, he's going to put a little newsletter out and he's going to send us what we need to get the, um, to get our debt token listed on Binance. And it wasn't nothing, it wasn't nothing crazy. Basically, if, if, if everybody did the, did the task, we'd be listed already. So he's going to put a newsletter out and get it out to us so we can all let the team know what we need to do so we can do it and get listed. Okay, that's what I love about this. It, it, so when it get listed, he said when it get listed, it can it, it normally it, he said it, it, the coin gonna go about thirty three hundred percent. I said, huh? <laughs> Just for it being listed, the coin will go up in value about thirty three hundred. Hey Jeff, I think hey, and Jeff, you, you're breaking up a little bit. I think Angel got a question for you. Go ahead, Angel. Yeah, you're breaking up a little bit, but I did have a question. So you're saying that when our coin gets so in the project. People sell the coin while the project's going on, and then you would be able to buy that coin on Binance. Like we would be able to go because we know what it is, and people don't know what it is, and we'd be able to go and buy more of the coin. Yeah. So in so in so in our in our, in our wallet, we can swap out USTD for the debt token. That's how I buy it. All right. When you swap and you're buying, right. you're, you're swapping USTD money. <laughs> For debt tokens money, so that's what I do. I, I did a um, yeah. I just swapped out my USTD for the debt token, and now I own 30, 32 debt tokens. Yeah, you know what? Right? Let me let me let me show y'all an example. I could I just, I just did it. Hold on, yeah. I did it today. So I'm a, let me show my screen. Let me let me let me jump on. Hold on. And I, I, I'm only swapping out because the license don't come alive again to January 2024. 
where you can buy the actual debt license and be able to mine it. And the power of buying the debt license, you're going to get the, when we get new licenses, if it's a thousand dollars or whatever, oh, and the drip is going to be, the drip is going to be less than a thousand dollars a license. So it's going to be crazy. Yes, um, after, but, after, yeah. after, after I show this, I want, I want you to also kind of walk through the micro license thought process. If you got, did you get any more info on that? Say it again. You broke the, up mi a bit. the micro license is coming up. Did they talk oh, about yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. So here's his, um, his my, here's the coins here, and here's the wallet. So once you have, you can get BNB in there. You have to, guys, you have to get some BNB in there because you need BNB to swap coins. And what you can do is today, you see, I have I had some tether in there for my commissions. I moved my tether in, and so I used some tether today to buy some. Uh, some grow. I bought grow at forty nine dollars. I bought forty nine dollars of black gold, and it seems already up to fifty four dollars today. I go grow black gold, so I swapped it. You do swap right here, and you can swap debt, or you can swap. Here in this case, I did USDT, so I had some USDT. So when you guys get your commission, uh, we have to show you guys how to. Take your commission in your wallet. And then I can search it for black gold. And it tells you how much per you would get. Try to get some de get some debt real quick. Uh, I did do that. Jeff, I actually I wanted to ask you about it because I did that today and it didn't and I and then I guess I went and did some I bought black I bought grow and something else after it and it used up the debt. <laughs> it took my debt I bought today. So let me see. Right, let me buy yeah. some debt. Hold on. Let me buy some debt, right? I'm going to buy some debt right here. So let's say I have some tether. I have $243 of tether. Let's say I do, I don't know, do, do 50 bucks. Let me see. Uh -huh. That's a 25%. Let's go. Okay. Now just, type, just, type, just, type, just type with a USDD. Just type 50. Yeah, so type 55 to get you like. Give you five, give you five of them bad boys. Right here? Yeah, so, that. So, so, I, that. so I can do swipe at like this? Yes. Yep, yeah. so you get yeah, 55, so you're getting... You're so getting it, and now look, you see, it says USC the debt, and it's, and, and it's, and it's getting me price... What's price impact? What does that mean? 30 cents. The price, at, at the, the price impact, you're on a little question mark. I don't know what that means, but the question mark right there will tell you. See a little question mark next to the word impact? If you click on that thing, it's going to it's gonna give us a, a description of what that means. Okay. I was trying to hit it, but it's not. There it is. Price impact refers to how much of the price of the token will vary because of the swap. Red is so severe. That? Yellow is moderate. Green is low impact. So it's not low impact. It's pretty good. So green is low impact, right? So that's yep. good, right? And then liquidity good. provider. So liquidity provider gets a fee. And this is how many yep. of my debt I'm going to get, right? So I can say that's confirm. Correct. Confirm, yep. And then do my password. And I got to do Google Authenticator. Confirm. You shop your yeah. see by blockchain, it may take some process where you see the actual results in your balances. Go scroll, scroll, scroll down to your debt right quick. Let me see something. More updates. Okay, yeah, you got no debt. You got no debt and now now refresh your refresh your job. Refresh? You know, yeah, refresh. Uh huh. Oh, there you go. See it popped up and moved up the line. Yep. Fifty five dollars. Uh huh. There it is, right here. Fifty-four dollars of debt. And you bought it for ten dollars and thirty-six cents. I yeah, bought mine for ten dollars. Yeah. So that's what happens when 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 they sell. Don't feel no way about the drop. Just when you buy the drop. Or yeah, but it, I'm buying it. I'm buying it with my token. I mine, right? So that's, I don't mind right. that, right? 
Because I'm, all your I'm producing targets. All your commissions, right? What all I my, did all was, my commissions, yeah, my commissions. So I, that, did, well, I got my commissions because what you do is, but this right here, to find out what, what kind of value you get, let me show you this real quick so you can understand which which token will provide the most value. You, you, you want to stop sharing? You, you, want me, you want to share? No, no, right there. You wait, wait. I'm driving. He grow? I'm driving. What do you want me no, to hit? Hit, hit? hit swap. Now, change black gold to grow. I mean, I mean, change black gold to debt. And then, and then click on debt up top. And click on aluminum real quick. And click on 50 percent. So, oh, click on oh, you you don't got you don't got no aluminum. I don't have no aluminum. Okay, got you. Click on aluminum again and click on something that you have. I have, uh, I have Bev. Where's mm -hmm. Bev? Where is it? Man. All right. No. Click the X. Click the X. Click the X on the um the right. Cause, yeah. Now click on fifty percent. Right. Right. So you see, fifty percent of of your bear portfolio right now will get you four point three debt tokens. Right. But if your if your portfolio was in the millions, fifty percent would get you so many bear tokens. Right. Right. Boom. Click on bear again. What else you got? I I have um I have um I have uh, natural gas. Click on that G. Do fifty percent of that. You see, Nat G. He got a lot of Nat G. He got more Nat G than he got Bev, but Bev fifty percent gives him more more tokens than his Nat G fifty percent. You see that? Why? Because the market price for Nat G is, is lower than the market price for Bev. So when I go and see which ones I want to swipe for, if I want to get that token, I'm going to see who got the, who give me the most value or the most tokens for the same percentage. And then right. I can decide from there. Right? Yeah. If not, I just I just use my USDD. If it don't make sense, I use my USDD real quick. Use my fiat money for that job turn the right, trash right. and get some more light tokens, right? Yeah. But other if, if I if, if I can mine it, I would rather buy a license to mine it. Yeah. The only reason why I'm buying debt token right now because there's there's, there's no license to mine it until next year. So I don't want to lose out at all. So I I rather get some than have none. Right. Questions. Now I wanted to um. Okay, let's do this real quick. Since we're recording this, let me stop sharing right here. And I want to show everybody. Uh, stop producing sharing. All right, let's go right here. Let me share my screen over here, guys. For your IX Global, let's do that here. IX Global. What do you guys have to do? You have to do your KYC. Uh, do your KYC, guys. In order to get your commissions, you must get do your KYC. All right, so you do my profile and KYC right here. It takes a picture of your front of your license and back of your license and a facial recognition uh, picture of your face. You have to do that, and then, and then once you do that, you're qualified to receive commissions. And then when you go to your payouts, you want to set where is it? Oh, okay. Payout is where you set. You can request the payout what's available for your commission. Uh, it's two weeks delay before uh, before your commissions are available. I mean, once you earn your commissions, two weeks before they become available to be paid. And what you want to do is every Sunday night is when you request, because if you do on Sunday, it'll be in your account on Wednesday. So what you want to do is also Jeff, what do we show how to put the payment in the wallet address? How do I show that here? I got to show it. Um, I mean, I forgot how to do that. Hold on. I, I remember. Dashboard. I think it's in my profile. Can I see view profile? 
I think you have to put no, but it was it there. It's not just some information. KYC. Um, oh, here it is. Your wallet address, right? Jeff, you're muted. Where's your where's the wallet? Where do you put our wallet address? So so pay out preferences. Pay out. They're gonna pay out and then pay out preferences. Pay out preferences, right? Right here. Okay, there is. So guys, you gotta choose what you want. You get paid by PayPal or there's a bank in Mexico or your USDT BIP20, which goes to your wallet. So in order, yeah, to, in, in order to configure it, click on you gotta click here and configure it here and put the wallet address. Where you get that from is you go to your uh I have to go go to your debt box, right? I think yeah. Yeah, you know I the train I did, they, 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 I'm about to load that train up so you guys can just watch it. All right, all right. so, so I, yeah, load it up on that I, I, IX Global uh, thread. That way they could learn. Yeah, because guys, there's an address to your wa to your dead box wallet, and it's and it's the same uh, Bit Twenty or USDT. So you can send your USDT from there, or you can send BNB from Binance on the Binance Smart Chain. That's how I was able to get Binance into my uh, joint there. Um, if you notice, I have Binance because you need Binance in your wallet to trade and swap. So once again, let me show that. Yeah, right. Let me let me make sure I go on. Uh, I think I have, there you go. So we got guys. Yeah, Hopefully you guys are watching this, so it'll be helpful to you. Once again, it's important uh, for, and I think the address is in the the dead box here. Let me show that to you real quick. Okay, here it is, in dead box right here. So if you want to receive, you click receive, and this is your dead box wallet right here. Because we're all remember that's the big the big bit uh Bitcoin smart chain thing. So that's it right there. That's your address. So when you send your BNB, I had to oh, I had to buy the BNB of Binance. I couldn't buy it on KuCoin uh because I had to send this address. It wouldn't take uh KuCoin wouldn't let me do BEP twenty on my uh USDT or BNB. and I can't buy BNB on KuCoin because it's a KCS. So I was able to do it off of Coinbase. And now I have, um, if you notice, I have BNB right here, right there, BNB. I have uh, $36 worth. Now I put $50 in, so it's already used $14 in gas fees to swap all the stuff I swapped today. Okay. So Does it um, communicate with um, Club Swan? Do you have any guys? I don't know about Club Swap. I know this connects. Jeff's going to show us how to connect to Trust Wallet. He did that training too. Right, Jeff? Did we lose Jeff? Yeah, yeah. So the easiest You're breaking up, Jeff. Jeff, you broke up. You broke up on that one. Say it again. Yeah, I said this wallet is actually a Trust Wallet. This debt wallet is actually a trust wallet. So all you're gonna need to do, and I, I got the video, I'm gonna, get, I'm gonna get the video out to you guys when I get back from Mississippi here. Um, so you guys can actually look at, I do it step by step. Um, you guys are on the train, those people that are on the train, they was on the training. But I do I do a step by step, show you how to actually get your debt box in trust wallet. So you, whatever's in here, you can see it. So whenever you upload some money in there, it immediately goes into here, where you don't gotta send it to, to, the, to, the, to the debt box wallet. Because your trust wallet is your debt box wallet. I know it sounds redundant, but just know that when you see it, you're going to be like, oh, wow. So you can buy a and b straight from your trust wallet, and it'll and it show up right here. Boom. So that you, know, you can swap how you want to swap. But yeah, your trust wallet is this be, this um, debt box wallet. And I'll show okay, you how to get it. So, yeah. so guys, you, you see, exactly. what I've done is I've had... Bev and natural gas was, was my uh, rental, was my natural, and Bev is my full professional license. 
So, and then to tell that I have in it is for my commissions I moved over from a couple of weeks ago. So I'm using this to buy other coins. I bought Grow, I bought Debt, and I have Black Gold now. So, and I have my Binance, which I put in there. So this is a, enabling me to get some of the coins. Once again, I'm just trying to accumulate coins. And what Jeff has taught me is when you get, like if I got two, three professional Y sisters feeding me coins and I'm in the beginning of the cycle, I could use those coins to swap some of the projects that are close to me to have some coins there in case they blow up. Because what Jeff saw was the ones that he did have blow up. So now he's making yep. sure he's covered, right? So Jeff's doing the same thing, basically. If you look at Jeff's, uh, Jeff's using his commissions. And, and guys, you, and I know um, Dwayne already has some nice commissions. Dr. Kareem got some nice commissions. Guys, it doesn't take, that's the other thing I want to share. It doesn't take much to get promoted in this thing to get some money out of this. You want to get three yep. people personal sponsored. And you want to get, once you start getting people get and they get their licenses, you get your uh, apprentice bonus. It covers your 145 per month. And then you get some volume in there. And next thing you know, you got a, a, a $87 in the first uh, per week. And then there's $200 per week, which is very attainable with about 10 to 15 people. So all you have to do, and remember, it's not just you. It's your three. Your three can get their three. And then, you know, you're looking at getting promoted. And that's every week you get the rank bonuses. Actually, let me, rank that. Let, me, let me show that. And binary. Let me let me show that. Yeah. Go ahead, you Jeff. Rank so you, and binary. Tell them I'm, I'm gonna bring up the screen so you talk about it because uh, I don't think we know. We've talked a lot about the compensation plan to the team. We the nodes are so nice, it's so sweet. I don't even concentrate on the comp plan to Jeff. Said, I said Jeff one day said we get paid on that too, and and so uh -huh. Jeff was like, yeah. And he showed it to me, and I was like crazy. Since then, hold on. Where is it? Yeah, I'm trying to. Where is it? Where is it? The dashboard. What's um? No, I have a a PDF of it. I'm just trying to figure out how to. Oh, gotcha. Um, yeah, I have a I have a dashboard. Hold on. I don't want to hang up on you guys. Let me move this thing up here. There you go. All right. All right here. There you go. So there's, this is the, um, this is the comp plan right here. Yeah, but I need the other one that shows the actual clients needed. Oh, I don't have. Oh, I didn't say that one yet. Client needed. Uh, yeah, say I mean people. Oh, see so when you, so you get it from the back office, right? Yeah. Yeah. Let me let me get that one. Where's that? Where's that? And uh. And going to Resources to Resource, resources. Resources. Promotional tools? Yeah, promotional tools, man. Download resources? Yep. And which one are I downloading? They're going on the um, second page, I think 70, 70 something. You're looking for the English presentation. The English presentation? Yeah. It's like 70 something, right? Look at it. We saw English presentation right here. Just download it or preview it? All right, we can preview it. All right. So we're going to page two with the same chart, right? That's correct. Hey, <laughs> 
There we go. Right here, right? You can see it? That's right. Let me, let me, swap, it. It the, let me swap it to the side. Mm -hmm. All right, go ahead. See there you go. You see it, guys? <laughs> go ahead, Jeff. So basically, yeah. um, if you had three clients uh, that because you're apprentice, you get the $100 uh, bonus plus you get $15 per membership that someone pays. That's the one forty five. So it covers your 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 fee. That's why they say if you get three people, you waive that fee. Uh, it's not waiving that fee. You cover that fee. They take out our commissions. That's right. And then when you get to uh one thousand forty a volume, and that includes people buying nodes on their membership. If you use twelve members, well, that's their membership, and you get that ten thousand forty. But if you have people buying nodes, you get that as well. You get eighty-seven dollars on top of the hundred you got, and the forty-five dollars from the fifteen dollars for each membership for each person. So you really start to look at some nice money per week, and then you get to thirty-six hundred, which once again, um, then you look at two hundred dollars uh, bonus per week. That's weekly. And uh, on top of everything else, so that's eight hundred dollars plus the uh, hundred apprentice bonus you got, and the fifteen per person, and and you and remember you get a direct commission every time somebody buys a license. Yep. And then you get volume and commission. One of the things that was confusing is a twenty eight day cycle. So they look at twenty eight days. So what Jeff does is he does everything by how many members you have, because if you qualify by membership, you will you once you return a rank. You have a cycle for it before uh, you re rank. So if you hit a rank and, you, and you're building, you should never ever worry about your rank. And if you have the people, but we are nowhere near tw um, 40 people makes you a producer, right? I'm a producer right now, but I think yep. I have maybe 20, uh, 20 something odd people. Correct. But so, and I'm I'm about me? to be, I'm about to be executive producer and and it's, but because we've been buying licenses, but what I want to do is we want to make sure we get more people in, and that's why I want you guys I want you guys focusing, especially with the micro licenses. What they're gonna do is we're gonna get people come in at a membership, which creates membership plus micro license. Now they get used to the process. They're perpetual. That means they're there to keep. It doesn't go away after sixty days. I like that concept. So now we can build it. Now remember, one micro license is gonna be one percent of and for fifty dollars. One percent of a total license. So if you do the math, a hundred of them is gonna give you a full license. So what you want people to do is when they start perpetually, you want them to get used to it, but you want them thinking to accumulate money to buy licenses. And that's what we're doing in funds and any other other programs we do, Novatech, whatever. We pull our money out there. We need people thinking to buy the 1,000 drip when it comes out or 1,000 uh, swipe when it comes out because now you get the coin, you get it the cheapest you're gonna get the license at. You have it perpetually for 10 years. You get the most coins up front. And now, you know, you have, you know, now we can accumulate and wait for the price to go up. And that's the strategy. And as you build your team, you get these members here, you get promoted, and you use those commissions to buy licenses as well. Everything should be about accumulating licenses and coins right now. And that's why I tell people, guys, I get a lot of people who say, a lot of you say, oh, the 145. Well, guess what? We're in funds right now. If you had $2,500 uh, sweet spot or a $1,000 sweet spot, you're making enough money to cover not only your $30 gold membership, but you're making money to help you start a membership here and cover it until you make money here. So you should look at our cash flow producing uh, funds, uh, presenting you an opportunity for you to fund your next business, your business that is the long term. To me, funds, we know what we're going to make with the combine calculator. It's just time. But here you have time element. You have you have technology, you have economics, and you have market factors that get, that can go from uh, 0, 0 0.85 to a penny. Jeff, you don't see you go from three zeros and a number to a penny. And what did it do? 
created a lot of millionaires. Oh, oh yeah, one hundred percent. So, guys, that's why I'm, I'm putting. Can imagine we have almost six hundred, seven hundred people in funds right now, and with the micro licenses, every one of them, as long as you have three hundred dollars or more in in six months, you double your money in funds. So, if you're six to three hundred, you go to six hundred. So, at some point, we can say, no, you know what? Take two hundred dollars, come in here, this project right here. You start building your micro licenses, and then in the next six months, you got another three hundred over there. And now you this is building. And now you have a team coming over that gets you promoted and everybody's making commissions to help them buy more licenses. To me, so it's the long term. Temporary play. licenses going away and micro licenses are gonna replace them? Yes, yes. The, the temporary license the rentals? The, uh, rentals are gone. They come in with the micro licenses. So basically it's a fractionalization of the license, but you, but they're gonna give you what they do is you're gonna do them. It's gonna be packaged in with the monthly membership, and you get X amount of licenses every month, so you can accumulate the micro licenses every month, which is kind of nice. And so you it build and you show you show you how to mine, how the mining works, and you start seeing your coins accumulate, and you can a nice easy starting point at two. I think they said they're gonna start at two fifty and up. Yeah, two fifty okay, is all cool. gonna be seen at five. Five licenses for two. Yeah, years. for two uh, fifty. Right. right, right, right. Now, mind you, they don't turn to NFT. They, 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 they're limited. It's like the full contract is buying a full block of uh, Bitcoin, and these micros is buying a percentage of the Bitcoin, not and not a full Bitcoin. But if you had owned the full Bitcoin, then it, and, you know, and you got the contract, it, 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 it would be NFT. So if you got a fraction of the contract, those fractions won't turn into an entity. Uh -huh. And so to get a hundred of those micro licenses will be filed out. Now, if you can get the other yeah. one, get the other one. But yeah. micro licenses are amazing too. Yeah. No, no, it is. I think they're all going to have, it's a, a great entry point. To me, it's about learning the process, how it works, and understand the economics of it. Because if you don't, you you know, you'll be frustrated. You come in, you come in, if you come in yeah. here to, you can't look at this as a return. What's my return on investment going to be? You can't, you have to look at this as this is my opportunity to turn, to get Bitcoin when it was $10 and $100. Knowing yeah. what I know today. That's simply yeah. what it is. And if you understand that concept, because you mean it, I could have Bitcoin, $100 Bitcoin and now it's 28000 Yep. Yeah. That's what we're, that's what this play is about. So and that's what it's going to be. Right. I can mention you. We, we could do right. retirement, uh, return on investment on, on funds and Novatech because, okay, fine, we're getting a percentage on our money, but we know how that is, right? That's cash flow. We tie up our money and they promise to pay it, right? This is yeah. about a time and economics. All right. Mm hmm. Guys, have any questions for Jeff while we're on? This is in your uh, back where office. Can I, where can I go in my back office to find uh, terms uh, so that I can understand like some of the common uh, common verbiage that we're using to understand what it means? You mean like where can you go? Huh? Where, where in the back office can she go to find out the common terms and terminology we're using? Are you part of the debt, uh, t uh, the, the, the Telegram, the debt to economics? Make sure you're part of that Telegram group, Angel, because they, they do a lot of stuff in there. Okay. Also, also, watch the documentary I put inside. Are you inside the WhatsApp um, group? Yes. Andrew? Yes, she is. The WhatsApp group, the Team Legacy. Are you there, right, Angel? I I believe I am. Yes, I can't tell you 100. So yes, you, yes, on, yes, 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 yes. Yes, you are. You are. I am. Uh, you, you and I will be having a conversation uh, very soon. No problem. Listen, I'm I'm gonna post some stuff in the. We have so many videos. I try not to overload you guys, but they're constantly posting stuff in dead box. So make sure you're part of that Telegram group, all right? And I'll I'll share the link with you. You it should it should be it should be, actually when you go to. Jeff, where is that uh the that list again? The get started list. Let me show her that. Um uh, let me find it. Hold on, let me find it. Where is it? Ice global, ice global. 
I lost my link already. Jump on the shuffle card that we have. Yeah, the sh the 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 where where it has um the checklist and stuff. In of, the uh, uh, in the in the uh, what is it called? App. In the baseball app. Oh, the Abyss yeah. That's right. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah, go to Abyss for I and make sure you're in that part of the Telegram groups, Angel. I, I actually, I'll okay. post it. I'll post it in the legacy look. I have some okay. uh, what's a node kind of thing and explains how nodes work. I have that. That's a nice little video. Uh, yeah, so I'd like I, to see that. I, yeah, I'll, I'll post it. I'll post some stuff there and I'll post this recording today's recording. Guys, uh, if you're watching this, let me let, let me look at Jeff here. Yeah, so let me show it. Are, are you guys? Jeff, are you guys? Go ahead, talk to yeah. the group. Tell them, tell them, expire. We got Boomy coming on at Thursday, seven o'clock. So we're gonna pack that call out. Um, we all make sure you get your licenses before the sale on Illuminate Explorer by uh, the fourteenth. One thousand dollar off, and Explorer gives you the most tokens of all the stuff. I learned from Jeff. Cool token accumulation is the game. So let's get the most tokens for our money, and it's a sale going on. And you, if said, not, you said Explore, Uncle Love? Yeah, Explore. You got a sale, a $1,000 sale off. Explore and aluminum. And aluminum. Explore and aluminum. Can I still yeah. buy Grow or I can't buy Grow? Grow's gone. Grow's sold, grow sold out. But I bought some Grow tokens today. That's what I'm talking about. You can buy some tokens, but I mean, you can't mine it right now. Okay. But you can't mine it. Yeah, but uh, Angel, you have um, let's um, if you want, we can do quick uh, go over because I think you have some commissions. You have some commissions that I don't know. Probably we have to start looking at that to see where your commit. So you move some of your commissions because once it's in your wallet, you can swap it for some grow. Okay, I'll do. I'll do that. We'll do that next time as we do a group, guys. I, I'm gonna share this to the team. So I want you guys to see you excited about it. Let's get. Boomy on Thursday. We got the flyer in there, and guys, let's get let's get our licenses, and let's get popping. Let's get popping. Let's get popping. Token accumulations the game. Token definitely accumulations. And and Jeff, Jeff and Jeff's gonna be posting. Too. Jeff's gonna be posting his videos this this weekend. They were really hot. Yeah. Okay, I'm looking forward to that. Thank you so All much. All right, Jeff, you the man. Thanks a lot, bro. Appreciate every one of you guys. All right, guys. Yeah, yeah, thanks this... for jumping on. Be safe traveling back, and I uh, will speak to you hopefully tomorrow. All right, guys. All right. Take action. Talk to you later. Stop All recording. Right,